I want to very quickly show you how to use Jira workflow properties to limit or restrict who can transition a ticket into a particular status. As you can see here, it's pretty easy for me to move a ticket into the in progress column, but maybe I only want the person who the ticket's assigned to, whether it's me or whether it's Garfield over here, to make that transition. So how do I do it? Well, you do it with a Jira workflow Property. I'm going to go to my cat GPT AI adoption project and go to space settings. I'm going to click on the workflows. I'm going to click on the link to edit the workflow. And when I come in here, I'm going to take a look at the transition into that in progress column. After all, it is the in progress column here where we want to restrict the transitions. So I click on the transition, that's the arrow right there. And I say, hey, I wanna put a Jira workflow condition in here that will restrict the transition. And specifically, I wanna restrict who can move an issue into that in progress column. So I select the restrict who can move an issue workflow condition and it says, who do you want to restrict it to? And I'll use the users option. I'll use though you can select roles, permissions, groups, users in a custom field. I'm going to restrict this to the user who is the work items assignee. That is what I want to do. Um, and I will then click add. That now adds this restriction that says, hey, only the person who the ticket is assigned to can transition it into the in progress state. Well, I'm from Missouri. Well, I'm going to click update workflow to make sure that that gets committed. And then I'm going to go back to this board here. Now, what happens when Garfield, that's who's logged in right here, tries to transition my ticket, the one assigned to me into in progress? Rejection. What about one that's not assigned to anybody? Rejection. What about the one that's assigned to Garfield? no problem and similarly if i go to my board so let's close out of here and go back to the kanban board let's take a look at the ticket that is assigned to me can i move it in yes no problem but can i move in ones that are not assigned to me no not at all and so there you go that's how easy it is to configure workflow conditions in jira and restrict transitions now i will say if you're interested in getting jira certified head over to certificationexams.pro we've got loads of jira acp 620 and 120 certification exams for you if you want to pass scrum gcp or github exams we got you covered there too